Yo, what is up everybody? It is me, Marty Zells here, back for a brand new video. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get the Cosme Rod inside of Infinity Gauntlet Thanos Simulator. So let's get straight into this. All right guys, so as you guys can see, I already have it here. So uh, yeah, I, I, I'll be able to showcase it in this video, which is good. So let's put that away because obviously you're not gonna have this during the fight. Now, also I have the Power Stone, which is the Game Pass, which luckily doesn't help you that much. So you can go ahead and if you have that, I wouldn't recommend taking it out. But the four main things you're gonna need is your Infinity Gauntlet, your Stormbreaker, your, okay, that was bright, uh, your Mjolnir and your secret weapon and I all made a video on each and every single one of these um, So if you want to go check those out before you watch this one, I highly recommend doing that also guys uh, Make sure you upgrade your infinity gauntlet and your stormbreaker as this is gonna be again very difficult without that So uh, if you, again, if you don't know how go check out my previous videos and uh, I show you guys how to do that in those videos so Let's get into this. So the reason why you're going to need these is because if you take them out, your health will increase. So I've seen some comments saying, how is your health so, so much? So currently I have, what is that number? I have 9 million health. So that's pretty crazy. So what we're going to go ahead and do is travel all the way over to the button because that, that is where you're going to be going to get this weapon. So uh, we're going to go ahead and if I can see, press this button. And so this is the place where these guys will spawn and this is where you're going to get the Cosme Rod. Now, just a quick thing before you go out and just fight them. So once you leave this platform, they will start spawning. Now, these guys are very, very strong. They do not hold back. So make sure you are prepared for anything. So good news though is if, if the boss spawns and you die, you will luckily keep the boss here the boss will not despawn so all you got to do is come back here and kill it. all right guys so um i kind of forgot the control so i might might be uh pretty bad at this but let's just go ahead and yolo here so as you guys can see these are the normal guards that will spawn so they're gonna do quite a lot of damage to you um so again there's like really like no good way i would say of taking these guys down as you guys can see these guys are pretty strong and they're gonna do a lot of damage to you so you got to make sure you also keep your distance but i think one of the ways to do good damage to these guys is actually just recharging and smashing the, on the ground like this um just because i think it just does enough damage so i don't think i'll get a boss to spawn in this video if i do that would be awesome but he is a very very low percent chance of spawning so you guys will probably have to do this for like a little while for him to spawn but for me i'm just gonna like sh hopefully he'll spawn but i i doubt it um so i got lucky when i was not that advanced in the game i just had him spawn in and uh i kind of just kept coming back when he killed me and trying to defeat him so uh yeah that was kind of how i defeated him and meanwhile i did not have all these upgrades so it was it, it took it took a little while but we still managed to defeat him so it is possible for some of you new players at this game to defeat him and i believe also when he spawned none of his guards spawned in um so that's so you don't have to worry about the guards which is good because the guards can get pretty pretty annoying quickly so yeah this is i, pro I would say the best best way of defeating these guys as you can keep your distance um because these guys do a lot of health like you guys do not want to be uh getting hit by these guys because especially if you don't have all these upgraded stuff they could probably one shot you so yeah just just be mindful of that that they're pretty pretty strong all right so so we're also like regenerating our health which is good gotta make sure we are not dying out here all right we are flying around the map so we gotta be careful we don't fly out <laughs> thank god there's barriers Alright, so we're doing a good amount of damage to these guys. Um, yeah, I, I just don't think a boss will spawn for me. Uh, I think when he, when he spawned, he was I think he was either purple or red. So he looks like these guys, he's just purple or red. Um, so yeah, it, it was just out of the blue, he just decided to spawn in. So, yeah. Alright, I'm going to take some more of these guys down. But as you guys can see, this is probably the best way of defeating him. The gauntlet is just not... It's just not the best way i would say um so yeah don't i don't recommend using the gauntlet unless you are like you know how to use the gauntlet like really really well 
I just don't recommend it. Um, I think Stonebreaker is probably the best, or even Mjolnir. But again, I'm not I'm not too familiar with the other weapons as much as I am with Stormbreaker. So yeah, uh, let's go back over up over here. Maybe we could get him to spawn. Yeah, I just don't think he's gonna spawn just because again he's a very low percent chance. And not saying that he he can't spawn. It's just some of you guys might have a bit more patience than I do at doing this. So uh, so yeah. But yeah, he is he is definitely possible, and um, as you guys can see, I'm not lying when I say it, because I do have the Cosmic Rod right here, and I told you guys exactly how I got it. So this is what it does. So I'm gonna, I'll showcase it now. So basically, let me just get some distance here. Basically, um, it, it does more damage than this. I, I don't know why it's doing so little damage right now. But um, so basically, all it does is shoot these beams. Now, I don't know why it's not doing that much damage. Um, but normally it does a lot of damage. Uh, it'll do like as much damage as the Stormbreaker was, but now it's just like doing like a portion of the health. Maybe I'm glitch. I don't know. Um, but yeah, it does a lot of these guys' health, and and because it's it's only ability, it is a lot of damage. Now let me show you guys why not to use a Power Stone because as you guys know in the other map the Power Stone is really OP. So if we take out the Power Stone. You're gonna see it doesn't do that much damage and you'll probably these guys will probably kill you before you kill them so power stone in this case is not that worth it mjolnir um i don't know it seems like these guys are invincible right now so let's go ahead and use this like thingy all right yeah it, it does quite a bit of damage but again i think i think the best way to defeat these guys is with the gauntlet so that is how you're gonna get yourself a cosmi rod um there we go. Now we're doing a bit more damage. I just don't know why. It, it must be a little bit buggy right now. But I promise you, this does more damage. Like, if we go back to the other place right here. Um, we get. I'll, I'll show you guys. It does crazy amounts of damage. Alright, so let's go to over here. And boom! It, it one-shots them. So, as you guys can see, it's crazy. It is, it is a little buggy, though. As you guys can see, it's not even doing damage here. But... When it does do damage, it is insanely overpowered. So let me try to like, yeah, there we go. That now we're getting some more. But I don't know. It's it is pretty buggy. So I hope this does get updated. Um, I do know that this game I don't think gets updated that frequently. So I'm not expecting one. But that is how you guys are gonna get yourselves a Cosmi Rod. I do highly recommend it if you already got everything else in the game. It's just a nice little addition. It does give you extra health. So if you guys see how does how do how do I have more health than you? That is going to be why, because I have the Cosmi Rod, and uh, the Cosmi Rod does give me give yourself more health. So, yeah, that is going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and thank you guys so much for the support on these videos that I make on this game. I really, I notice it, and I really do appreciate it, so I'm trying to give you guys more and more and more. Um, and yeah, so that is going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!